on the screen we see the results of an analysis of um, a model that contains a moderating effect here. Let's see this moderating effect. Let's see the plot for this moderating effect. So I'm going to go to view plot linear and nonlinear relationships among Gleaton variables. And the moderating effect is always shown with an asterisk as a product of latent variables. So this is the, the uh, particular moderating effect. I'll click here. And I'm taken to this graph, which is a one of the many 3D and, and, and two, 2D graphs that can be used to view moderating effects. So this is a 3D graph, it's a called a rocky 3D graph. Um, they're smooth, so there are several rocky uh, graphs where the, the uh, algorithm that is used to create the surface creates a rocky surface. A smooth surface can be uh, obtained through one of these options here, so let's go to this one. So you see there is a smoothing effect with this algorithm. Then we can also view uh, the moderating uh, relationship using a focused 2D graph, which is this one, which can be particularly useful in, in viewing the, uh, the uh, moderating relationship. So this is the relationship for low values of the variable e collab or e collaboration and this is the relationship for high values. So th the difference between these two, the inclination of these two lines is what defines uh, the moderating relationship. I have also the same graph with data points. So here the, da the data points crowd a little bit. The, the focus graph uh, is with the data points excluded and it focuses on this area here where the effect is in whereas the, the graph with the data points included is a little bit more crowded the screen. And we also have the option of seeing the moderating effect with uh, uh, two graphs side by side. Now let me go to uh, the, the Rocky 3D graph for the moderating relationship. So here what characterizes the, the moderating relationship is that the moderating va variable here is e collab. So as the value of this moderating variable goes up, increases, there is a change in the inclination of the relationship between this variable, project management, and this variable, success. And you can see this, that the inclination changes in that it's almost flat at the beginning and then this inclination increases as Ecolab increases. We can see this a little bit better by rotating the graph. So you can go to rotate, rotate left. So I do a few rotations like this and then I'm here, I, I can see uh, this a little bit better. So we can see here that the relationship between project management and success is kind of flat in the beginning and as the value of the variable e-collaboration which uh, refers to e-collaboration technology use as the value of this variable goes up then we see the inclination going up. Uh, this uh, focus graph shows this perhaps in, the, in an easier to understand way and the smooth graph shows it uh, in, in a way that uh, it's a little bit smoother, uh, the variation. So this concludes this demo on how to view moderating relationships using 3D and 2D graphs.